right, so here he is, Surrey Nobbs, Jarzinho Rosen strike the first man or woman from his nation to compete on the greatest proven ground in mixed martial arts. And this guy's done a whole lot more than compete since transitioning from kickboxing. He's been undefeated as a mixed martial artist. He was the UFC's Rookie of the Year in 2019. Alistair Overeem's got a story about this man's power, and perhaps tonight's opponent will have one to tell after the festivities tonight. Jarzinho Rosenstrike, Biggie Boy, is back for more tonight. Well, always exciting when this guy shows up on the fight card, Daniel. He is a true mixed martial artist. Not really any glaring weaknesses, at least, that he's put on film thus far. He's the new breed of fighter. Those kids that start doing everything at six years old. They start wrestling. They start doing jujitsu. They start to box. He's one of those guys that has every one of those skills, and he does them all at an A-plus level. He's got tremendous cardio. He is the type of fighter that in a few years will just litter the UFC roster across the board. And oftentimes his opponents will say he doesn't really do anything special, but he does everything at a plus level, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup tonight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So three years the gap in age between these two fighters, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 12 wins, four losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 260 pounds, fighting out of Coconut Creek, Florida, Yes, in yo, Biggie Boy, Rose and Strike! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 14 wins, 4 losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Busan, South Korea, the Korea Super Boy, Do Ho Choi! All right, grip through the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, to back your corners, come out fighting. I mean, these guys are the best of all the mixed martial arts. They can do everything when they're locked inside of the octagon. I'm so excited to watch the highest level of MMA on display tonight. Oh, nice strike landed there by Shaw. All right, first round is underway here. We say in mixed martial arts, it's one thing to have the reach advantage. It's another thing to use it. We'll see if he can get that jab going. Tonight. He has got to fight tall. He's got to stay at range, use his length to give his opponent problems, trying to bring the fight into a closer distance. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, and he always brings his hands right back to his face. Oh, that right hand is on point. Oh, just out of range with that right hand. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. 
right. Gets caught with that punch. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this guy. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy tonight. He's doing a great job being accurate, but he's also very fast. Look at the hand speed. Right. Afraid to get that head off the center line. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. What? Blocks the shot. Under three minutes now to go in round one. Rosen strikes circling to his right. Rips the body there. Nice kick landed there by the Korean Super Bowl. Keep your hands up for me. Come on now. Let's go. Slips the punch. Oh, looking to counter with his left hand, but he misses. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Big leg kick land. Leg kick checked nicely by Chor. Just misses there with the left. Oh, and there he goes working off that jab again. How's your jab? I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab, but you realize that as MMA evolves, Guys will start to fight behind a very educated jab. It's just like boxing. The most thrown punch in the first one you learn is a jab. Right. And in MMA, guys are starting to take that same approach because it is such an effective weapon. I need you to get that takedown now. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Beautiful strike. Beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Tags him with the left. Flush right hand is true. Trying to establish that jab once again. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but it doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that one. That's a big strike right there. Oh, Rosen strikes lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. That's the cardio that I used to see right there, just like in training. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. Round two is upon us. Your thoughts on round one, champ? Round one was a very close round. Both sides had their moments, but nobody has really went out ahead in the race as we go into the second round. Just out of range with that right hand. The Korean Superboy gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Try to establish that jab. Come on, man. I need Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Nice right hand. 
Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Well, missed on that one. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Straight right hand, no good. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Hands higher, hands higher. Really making good use of his reach advantage there with that punch. Well done to block that powerful kick to the box. Strike gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Looking to land the right just out of range. That uppercut is good. Oh, big left hook there. Leg kick checked by Biggie Boo. Just misses with that big right hand. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Oh, he hurt him bad with a jab. And both guys really throwing with authority. And now he's hurt. That's one of those shots that if you take one of them, if you end the night, that one landed right on the spot. Just missed with the elbow there. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Nice punch, Lance. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. He goes with the combination of punches to the head. Potentially some concussive damage there. I mean, absolutely concussive damage. Landing all those strikes to the head. He's very accurate. He's very fast. And he has a real confidence every time he throws his punches. Nice kick there by Short. Oh, significant strike attack there, but a huge block. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by the Korean Super Bowl. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Hey, beautiful punch. Oh, Rosen strikes lower jaw, is extremely swollen now. Compromise, DC. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. And that was a perfect shot. Punch coming is blocked. Just out of range with the big right hand. Ten seconds to go in the round. That was the nice strike. Wilson strike gets absolutely melted by that head kick. All right, so a crowd-pleasing five minutes in the books. DC, take us through some of the highlights. Punch after punch landed right on his opponent's face. Did a great job of finding his target, locking in, and then getting, the, getting his fist to the target in that round.
All right, pretty good back and forth action in the previous two rounds. Your expectations here as this next round gets started. I expect the action to really pick up now. These guys have to lay it on the line as we start to Oh, huge connection there. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves so oh! Right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Up the middle. Punch him in the back. Nice Go punch by Biggie Boy. Recover. Move and recover. He's looking to land the right just out of range. All right, so he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with him, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Rosenstreich. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to throw counters after blocking shots. Three minutes to go. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right here. That one appeared to stun him. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, big left. the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Wow. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. And he connects with a the punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Oh, misses with the jab. Take that, take that. Take it now. Take him. Take him now. Huge block there. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch, like just puts a smile on my face. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot. Yeah, looks a little on his feet. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Right hook to the head block. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages.
that is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliani has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 19 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Yazinja Biggie Boy Rodich. Well, we congratulate him on a huge knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he's 